Hey guys, sorry about the background. I know I always have American Girl dolls in the background, or my room's in the background, or something else, but, um, so, yeah, this is just, um, uh, well, you see, I believe I'm a Christian, um, and today I'm going to be doing what I believe about God and some verses. So, yeah, if you guys want to watch this video, you can. And if you are not Christian, that's absolutely fine. But I am. And so, if you guys are not and you don't want to watch that video, that's fine. But if you are you can watch this video or not. It's your decision if you think this is going to be boring or something. It's just going to be a bunch of words. But, yeah. In the background, you see Josephina. She's still in her swimsuit for my swimsuit video. That didn't go too well. So, I'm not putting that on YouTube, guys. Sorry. I really want to, but uh, it kind of turned out horrible. So, yeah. Okay, so... So, uh, let me go. Okay, so, what I believe in God is, I believe that he died on my sins. He died on the cross for my sins. And he thinks that I am perfect. And in his eyes, I am perfect. In real life, I'm not so perfect. Um, you know, everybody lies. That's part of life. Now, we try not to lie, which is kind of hard when you're younger and my age. But you still can stop yourself from lying. Just because you're lying doesn't mean you're going to get in trouble or anything. Your mom will totally understand why, and, okay, she might be, like, that much mad at you, but everybody makes mistakes, and so here is, um, sorry guys, let me, Okay, so I'm going to read this, um, and this is what God said, okay? So here we go. All power is given unto me in heaven and in earth. Go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost, teaching them to observe, 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 observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you and I am with you all the way all the way even unto the end of the world amen amen to, amen to that because that is completely true Now, guys, if you do watch this video, I want you to comment down below. And if you're going to be commenting down bad things about God, don't watch this, okay? Because that is just horrible, okay? God is the one who died on the cross for your sins, and you're bad commenting him? Really, people? That's just crazy. I mean, if you're watching, if you're watching this video... I'm telling you, don't bad comment, or I will take this video off YouTube. No, you know what, I'll keep it on YouTube, and I'll change it, and I'll say, this is the Lord, he accepts us for who we are, and you're bad commenting him? Yeah, whatever, I don't think so.
Sorry guys, I just get a little tongue with that. Um, okay, here's, I'm going to read two other verses, then I'm going to tell you guys what to do on Sundays, okay? Okay? See though, say nothing to any man, but go thy way, do thyself to the priest, and offer for thy cleansing those things which Moses commanded from a testimony unto them. Here's the other one. They that are whole have no need of the physical, but they that are sick. I came not to call the righteousness, but sinners to repentance. Repentance or something, I don't know. Okay, here's another one, guys, that I want you guys to listen really closely, okay? Is the lawful to do good on the Sabbath days or to do evil, to save life or to kill? Now, I believe to save life and do good on the Sabbath days. Now, okay, so I'm going to talk about a little what to do on Sunday. So if you are a Christian and on Sunday, or you don't go to church, or something like that, and you're usually on your, um, on your, uh, Kindle all day. Well, that's the, whoa, what the, sorry guys. Well, that's. Mm, not what you want to do. If you're spending time on the Kindle, why don't you get a Bible app, okay? Say you don't like reading. Well, if you get the Bible app, it can read it to you. So, it, you can get that to do on Sundays if you don't go to church. And those who do go to church, you could still, when you get home from church, you can just go, go over, maybe hang with your friends for a little bit, Come back, and once you're done with hanging with your friends, go to the Bible again and read a little bit about, or just go to your tablet and read a little bit about it. Or now, if you are older, like 10, 9, 11, I would say you would want to read the book because you need. I mean, the reading practice would be good, and, yeah, so. So, yeah, you know what, when I'm on Sundays, if I'm not making videos about this, then I'm usually sticking my head in my Bible. <laughs> so, yeah, or I'm playing doll. But guess what I'm doing well on Sunday dolls? I got the Bible on and I'm listening to it while I'm playing dolls. You know what? When I when I I'm get I'm sitting up for this thing that says I love God, it's a American Girls T shirt and I'm gonna get it and it says I love God. So I'm gonna get that and use that. So yeah. So guys, I really recommend you to see this video because it's really good to know that God is with you and that because what would we do without God? We wouldn't have food or we wouldn't have animals. We wouldn't even we we we, we, us, we wouldn't even be alive if God wasn't here. So, I really want you guys to just stop and think about it. Stop in the middle of your foot track. Sit down when you're on a really long walk and think about 
man. God is wonderful. He gave me so much. And so guys, thanks for watching. Comment down below of what you think of this video and thank you guys so much for watching this. Bye.